I would do anything just to get you back again. I would do anything at all. I know I'm not innocent. You deserve a better man. But let me just hold your hand once more. All right, y'all, what's going on, guys? Back again with another video, back again with another video, back, back, back again with another video. So when you see this gorgeous and handsome face, might I add, you already know that there's more Pokemon Go info. So in today's video, like I said yesterday, I wasn't going to make another video. Actually, what I was going to do was make this video for tomorrow. But I mean, it was just eating at me and I had to get it out to you guys. So I'm getting it out to you guys for now. Cause that's what I do, I'm a YouTuber, so I have to get it out for you guys, that's my job. So, with that being said guys, and besides, I'm off today, so that's good. So, and I'm also off tomorrow, so I can participate in all the greatness of the events for tomorrow. But also, not only am I off tomorrow, and I'm off today, but I also got, wait for it. That's right, the snacky snacks. So, you already know what I'm gonna be doing, be chilling, watching TV, just relaxing, you already know. That's what you do when, when you off. But anyway, guys, we're going to jump into this video because it's it's going to be kind of short. And it's going to be also kind of sweet, too, because it's, it's about the newest raid boss that's coming to Pokemon Go. So, guys, with that being said, we're not going to jump into this video now. But we're going to jump into this video right now. Let's go. Oh, I am a believer. Oh, don't know where I'll be if I'm not free to take a lead. Oh, I am a believer. What's going on, trainer? Sorry to butt in just like before. Listen, at the time of me, me making this video, I was talking about Diaga coming to Tier 5 raids between the 27th and the 28th of this month, but I got a, twi a tweet on Twitter stating what Pokemon was coming as part of the Community Day for next month. And it happens to be Trico. And I was just... Talking about Trico, so that, that's pretty funny, but I guess when you talk something into existence, it happens. But anyway, we're going to talk about, not even talk about, but I'm just going to show you guys, because I haven't had a chance to show you what shiny Trico, Grovile, or Sceptile looks like. In case you already do, so be it. But if you don't, here's what they look like. Alright guys, now, back to the video. All right, trainers, get ready to lace up your boots once again, because on the 27th and the 28th, the new, the newest uh, Tier 5 Raid Boss is actually going to be Dialga, and there's a chance for it to have its shiny form out also. So, leak Pokemon Go new event and legendary Raid Boss coming February 27th and 28th. So if you do not have your Palkia like me, now's the time to go and get it which I will be doing hopefully this weekend along with the other events um, and while I was making this video I was gonna make another video because I just found out about community day and which Pokemon that it's gonna be for next month but instead of doing that I thought I combined it and make all one video so with that being said guys let's get into the rest of this story right here stay tuned all right, so it says, Trainer, Stardust Pokemon Go Twitter account has a new double exclusive leak, which refers to a new event and new dual still, new dual type still dragon legendary raid boss, Dialga. So, let's jump into this again. So here, Stardust Pokemon Go account didn't share much on the new event because obviously he doesn't have enough information for even me to give to you all. So... It says accept the date. So the date, which is on February 27th, more info to follow. So on the 27th, because obviously on the 28th, Palkia leaves the uh, Tier 5 raids at 4 o'clock for us in the, in the Americas. Now, as officially confirmed by Niantic, the legendary raid boss Palkia will leave Pokemon Go raids on February 28th. And as leaked by Stardust, Pokemon Go, Dialga will take over the legendary raids. So, actually... Well, I'll get into that in just a bit, but I'm going to read this and then I'll tell you what I was going to really tell you. So, anyhow, Dialga is a dual-type Steel Dragon Gen 4 Legendary Pokemon that is the game mascot of Pokemon Diamond and 
and a member of the creation trio of Sinnoh representing time. Because obviously we already know the spatial Pokemon Palkia is leaving bat uh, raid battles on the 28th. But I was just thinking that maybe somehow, some way we'll see Dialga and Palkia. But then I forgot the two dates, 27th and the 28th. I was thinking of something else. So sc just scratch that part. I just want to tell you what I was thinking. Anyhow, uh, so yeah, let's jump into the second part of the video. Stay tuned. Actually, before I do that, I just ran into this, and I want to mention this to you all. So, basically, Diago, like I said, will replace Palkia, obviously, as I just mentioned, uh, on the 28th. So, basically, the max CP, this is what we're going to get into, the max CP of Diago. It's 48,742, that's the boss CP. Uh, level 20 is going to be 2,307 CP. Level 25 is 2,884 CP. Because it's going to be weather boosted in snow and windy weather. And yes, it still can particularly snow at this time. Uh, so yeah, so this will be the uh, weather boosted CP. Max CP. So uh, yeah. Let's see what this says. An event on 21. Oh no, that's the same thing I just read you guys. Oh, anyway. No, 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 no. This is the event on uh, the February 27th for celebrating Game Boy's birthday. So happy birthday, Game Boy, I guess. Uh, so guys. Let's jump to the second part of the video. Let's go. All right, trainers. So basically now we're going to talk about Community Day, which is actually takes place in March, which is next month. Uh, and I actually was talking about this uh, the other day. What if we had Shiny Trico? And well, here we are. Just like when I was at the park last month or the month before that, when we, whenever we had Shiny Psyduck, well, I was say, saying and wishing that we had Shiny Psyduck. And that's what happened. It turned out to be Shiny Psyduck. So, not that we had Psyduck Community Day, but that was just an event that we had. So that was cool, but it wasn't like, you know, Community Day or anything. But you guys get what I'm saying. Uh, but yeah, so with that being said, let's get into the rest of this video. Because this, like I said, this is going to be a really short video because uh, it's not really too much, you know, speculation or anything like that. But anyway, uh, yeah, so let's jump into this. Okay, so basically, like I said, the feature Pokemon is Trico. Bonus is it's pretty much like every other community day, but yeah. Anyway, bonus is one fourth egg hatch distance. Uh, March 23rd, 2019, which is next month, the end of toward the end of next month, 3 p.m. to 6 p.m. And the reason why they're changing it is because they want people to engage more during like nighttime. And I'm gonna show you an article um, about that in just a moment. The exclusive move is unknown, but like I heard on Twitter, it might be the same as every other grass type Pokemon, which is Frenzy Plant. So 10 to 1, it might be Frenzy Plant. But anyhow, bonus is lure, three hour lures. So uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Like I said, it's really no speculation like that, but uh, I'm gonna let you guys know why it's 3 to 6 p.m. Like I said, I sh told you why, but I'm gonna show you an article to uh, back up my words. So guys, stay tuned for that before I wrap this video up. Stay tuned. All right, trainers, so basically, this is from Niantic Support. It says, new for March Community Day. Start time will be based on your local time, wherever you are. So no matter where you are in the world, on March the 23rd, from 3 to 6 p.m. is when the Community Day is actually going to start. So it's going to start for everybody from 3 to 6. So they changed it. They moved it up one hour for everybody. Some people are actually mad. I'm going to show you a couple of tweets in a minute. Uh, it's your Community Day time with an extra hour to fully evolve Trigo, which we already know about that. We've been doing that thus far. So guys, stay tuned for some tweets. You're probably gonna be pretty, I don't know, you're probably just gonna start laughing. But anyway, here we go. All right, so basically you have some people that's complaining, some people that's not complaining. Uh, you know, but Niantic only wants to do this because they, they, they're trying to change certain things because they see the complaints. And they know some people have weather problems, weather issues, what, you know, whatever. Some people who have school, job so they're trying to see if they can please everybody which we all know out here in the world you cannot please everybody and that's just the way it is i mean you know you have to kind of work around it play around it you know um but yeah so that's pretty much it and they talk about clamp pro day but um yeah so basically guys that's gonna wrap this video up uh make sure you guys like comment sub share this video wherever you share cool stuff Comment down below, smack a like on this video, crush the notification bell so you can stay updated on my latest videos. Make sure you turn post notifications on so you can also stay updated on my latest videos. 
And as always, guys, peace and love and stay blessed. And I'm out. Peace. I met you in a crowd of people I felt for you, nothing to do